Just want to say before you watch this video, this video will only really make sense if you've seen any of my other search operator videos, which I will leave in as a card now on the top left or top right or bottom. No idea where it's going to appear, but it will appear somewhere. If you want to watch that first, if you haven't seen any of my search operator videos before, and then let's get right into this video. Hey guys, what is going on? Hamish here from Income Stream Surfers, and today I wanted to do something that I very, very rarely do and admit when I was wrong. Um, this, this video is going to be about this comment by Chris Hughes, which says, Hi there, fascinating videos. Thank you very much. Really appreciate it. But I have some questions about your search operator. If I try your search operator with in title color melt, I see no result. Yet a simple query like site redbubble.com in title color melt finds an entry for color melt t-shirts with exactly 59 results. Do you have any idea why the search operator is not giving the results when Google has clearly indexed it? Thanks. The first thing I'll say is I did originally say that the search operator method is very temperamental. It doesn't always work. For example, Sometimes you put zero to a hundred results and it's giving you things with 300,000 results and Sometimes it does exactly what Chris has said here um, Cheers for the comment Chris and I'm actually going to show you guys a Newer version of the search operator method, which I think is going to actually benefit a lot of people So let me first of all, let me just remove this comment so you can see um, This is the search operator I used if I simply delete the specifics, then you can see what Chris said is right. Um, I can't actually load uh, this because Redbubble is not loading at the moment, which I really hope they fix as soon as possible because, I mean, uh, it can really negatively affect their SEO if it's not loading. So I really hope they fix this soon. Um, but yeah, one of these, this here has 53 results. Okay, so what Chris said is completely true. Uh, and this got me thinking, um, maybe my search operator method is not perfect, and it's not. So instead, I suggest that you guys use this, uh, sorry, in-text uh, results. Um, and then for some unexplainable reason, look, by the way, five, uh, 500 server error, this is terrible. Come on, Redbubble, you need to fix this as soon as possible. I can't even load their website at the moment, guys. This is really, really bad. Uh, hopefully it's from my side, but I, I don't think it is. I think five. Oh, okay, it's loading now. Okay, anyway, back on topic. Um, for some reason which I cannot explain, Google is showing the least competitive results first. There are some which have quite a lot of competition, but in general, nine results, 52 results. Okay, that one's 1,200, but that's fine. 22 results, 36 results, 17 results, 10 results, etc. So guys, this will be a less um, constricted, a less restricted, sorry, search operator. There will be no restrictions. You will see things that have millions of results. You will see things that have one result, etc. Um, this will be an improved version because you can just look here and you can see the results without opening the Redbubble page, okay? And you can just take the, so Redbubble is not working properly at the moment, but I can still do everything I need to check the, uh, okay, I'm actually not going to do that one because it's probably, um, uh, it's probably, what's it called, it's copyrighted. I'm just going to do a couple, see if we can find a good one while, while I'm talking. But yeah, guys, I'm actually really happy that Chris left that comment. It's really, really helpful to me. Um, and it might have just improved the search operator method because we are no longer restricting ourselves and we can still see, holy moly, we can still see some, um, we can still see the results on the search engine result page and we can just ignore the ones that have a lot of results. So let me just do a quick test. Hello, Bello. So in title, hello, Bello. This is a this is a brand by the way, so don't do this. Um, and then if I put results um, zero to one hundred results, yeah, it doesn't appear. 
which is really strange. I, I'm, I'm really not sure why. Yeah, okay, the search operator method that I originally have uh, given to you guys is flawed completely. Okay, this, this part of the search operator is unnecessary. Just remove it. And yeah, I'm going to say this is my perfected uh, search operator. Chris, you have saved us. Thank you so much. So guys, just go through go through this. Okay, you'll see that some have high uh, high results, high competition, but some do not. Okay, and then the rest of the method is the same, guys. You just find ones that have good um, searches every month, which this does not, and then you uh, see where um, Redbubble is appearing on the SERP search engine result page. Which it's not on the first. Oh, is it? Oh, yeah, it is on the first page. Okay, so let's say this had a thousand uh, results, guys. This is the same as usual, and it's uh, number nine on the SERP. We know that this is a good keyword. So to summarize, um, get rid of the specifics because it's not working. And I, I was really, I'm a little bit angry about this because it should work, but it doesn't. It does work sometimes, but other times it doesn't which means that we could be losing out on keywords, guys, which is the last thing that I want for, you, for my viewers. I don't want to uh, make them miss out on keywords. So new search operator method is this. Get rid of the specifics. Just put siteredbubble.com in title, any keyword, in text results. The reason that you want to write in text results here is so that it shows the amount of results per page and it makes your life a lot easier. Uh, I just want to search one more just to see if this has good uh, results. It doesn't. It does. Okay, very interesting, guys. This could be an absolute killer keyword if we are appearing here, which we are not. Mm, no. Oh, okay, it's from Willy Wonka. No problem. Okay, guys, so please uh, stop using the... Uh, inverted commas with uh, 0 to 100 or 0 to 10 or whatever because it's not working very well and it's a little bit buggy and you could be missing out on keywords so yeah I'll see you in the next one guys I really wanted to make this video very quick just so that I could admit that um, maybe I was wrong and that there is a better way to do this this is much less restricted much more open much more results etc 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 I would just say this is this is um, this is a perfect way to do it. Okay, I'll see you in the next one, guys, and peace out.